Good morning, everyone. Uh, welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'll be sharing my experience um, with upgrading my Dell 8930 uh, XPS um, memory upgrade. So originally, I bought it with only 16 gigabyte. And uh, while I was doing some uh, kind of video editing, uh, dealing with 4K alongside with my um, GoPro Hero 7, you know, uh, the system, the software that I use is uh, keep on crashing. So I, I decided to uh, do a little bit of upgrade. So I added a, um, a 32 gigabyte more RAMs to it. So this is uh, the side view of your uh, Dell desktop. There should be like a couple hinges back here where you can just lift it and then you can remove it. Okay. And as you can see, uh, this is not my actual computer. Okay. This is just some of the, the random uh, pictures that I found on the web. Okay. I'm just going to use this uh, for reference only. So, okay. So, the hinges on the back, if you you just play with it, you can open it. And then this door here with the power supply will completely swing to the right. And as you can see, here is uh, here are the two uh, RAMs that we're talking about. So looking at this one, it, it could be 4 gigabyte, 4 gigabyte, or it's uh, 16 or, uh, or 16. But in this case, in my case, it's 8 gigabyte and 8 gigabyte. So... When you, you install it, you can see that you have to put it on a line with the color. Okay, so I hear you can see that either you put it on two blacks or you put it on two whites. Don't just put on one on black and one on white. Okay. Here, this is a, a clearer picture where you can see. So if originally, if your my, my uh, 16 gigabyte, I would be like one on here and the other one will be on right here. Uh, one on white and that one's on white. So my other 16, two 16 would go into the one black spot and the other black slot, okay? And then to, to install this is pretty easy. So all you gotta do is you see like the, uh, the two ends of each rams, you just push it down on both sides at the same, same time and then you can remove the rams, okay? And to install it, you just uh, make sure you line up with the uh, line up all together, and you just push it down gently. And then the two ends, well, you will hear a click if you do it correctly, properly, okay? So these are the one that I bought from uh, Amazon uh, a couple, maybe four or five days ago. Um, and for one hundred and twenty four ninety nine, and I just checked the price right now. I think it dropped down to one seventeen. Um, I'm gonna leave the link in the description uh, for your reference. Um, as you can see, I read a lot of reviews from Crucial, and the majority of the reviews are really good. Okay, so that's why I decided to buy Crucial, and this is the the speed twenty six 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 six. Okay, and this is what I got straight from the Dell website. It says here memory specifications. So the type is DDR4, speed up to 2400 MHz, processor i3, and up to 2666, i5, i7. So mine is uh, i7, and it's a ported per slot. It says here each slot can use 4, 8, and 16. Total memory, 8, 16, 24, 32, and 64. Uh, I'm not sure why they didn't list 48 here. Because I upgraded my system. And as you can see here, too, you don't see no um, 8, 8, and then 16, 16. And they, they skipped it. But this is a picture of... Uh, the final installations for my system. And as you can see here, it shows 48, okay? Intel i7, 9700 CPU 3.0. And 
So the actual memory originally eight. I still keep the the two eight, but I added sixteen sixteen, and it come up to forty eight. So uh, I checked on the Dell forums. Uh, a lot of them says uh, you can't do it, but uh, as you can see here, it works perfectly fine. Even though on the Dell website they didn't list about forty eight, they skipped it from thirty two and jumped to sixty four. Uh, but you can actually upgrade it to you know only uh, 48 because I didn't want to uh, toss away the other two pieces of RAM that I have so I just order you know what I can to fill up the other two slots um, I'm not sure if the motherboard can support uh, 32 gigabyte each slot uh, I, I doubt it you know the website says no but I haven't tried it so I don't know so if any of you out there that, you know, try like two pieces of uh, 32 and you see if uh, the motherboard detects it and, and if it works and uh, let me know and share with the uh, with every, everybody else. But other than that, that is my uh, presentation or that is my video for the day. If you guys like the video, um, please give it a thumbs up. If you guys have any questions, leave it in the comment below. Other than that, take care and uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you very much, guys. Yeah.